Hello, people of the world. CJ all day one one three zero here, and <laughs> I can't believe I'm gonna show you these two graphics cards, but I'm just gonna show them right now. <laughs> this is a little piece of history for me because I can't believe I'm, I, I can't believe I still have these cards, and I'm about to show you them. This is the PNY Verdo five hundred and twelve megabyte GE Force. GT 9400, well, 9400 GT. This was released in August of 2008, and this is the graphics card that we had uh, back then uh, in 2008. And by we, I mean my uncle and I, when he was still living and I was making a lot of YouTube videos for no reason. Now I have a reason to this video. Anyways, <laughs> um, back in 2008 when this card was released, this was the card to get when you got games like World of Warcraft or, or um, some uh, basic uh, games that require a better GPU with better VRAM to run it. So, this was it. There is a 1 gigabyte version that PNY released, but I can't, uh, I, I couldn't even, um, I don't think we even got it. It, it was, it was like much more expensive. This, um, graphics card cost $162 when it was released, and it still costs that much today, actually, so, uh, not much has changed in terms of price. So, uh, back in 2008, if you were on a budget and you were looking for a graphics card for gaming, this was it. This thing had S-Video and two um, DVI um, uh, things, but luckily it came with a DVI to VGA adapter so that you could, um, if you had a VGA monitor, you could use that. But if you had an uh, if you had an S video cable and a TV, you could use that too. The next card I'm going to show you is the graphics card that came with my computer, uh, which is the computer I'm currently using right now. It is an MSI GE Force GT610. Uh, this is a one gigabyte VRAM. And let me tell you, it sucks. It can't even run um, Wolfenstein the New Order so well. I mean, it was terrible. It was really terrible. And I'm so glad I got rid of it. Well, I, I really didn't get rid of it because I just got it out of my computer and replaced it with the, um, with the GeForce GTX 960. So I have replacements. So... Uh, a replacement, that is. I'm still looking to replace my um, CPU, so. Um, <laughs> when um, I got this card, I really didn't think much about it. It's kind of the same thing with this card. Uh, when I got this, I didn't think much about it. Because, you know, uh, when I had Windows XP and I installed this into my computer, it ran everything from World of Warcraft to um, Gary's Mod to Minecraft. It ran them so well. And it ran them not near perfectly, but it ran them to little to no, from little to no lag at all. And I could play them no problem. So uh, with this card, it was kind of the same thing. Um, but it was more of a if you play if you try and play the later games you're gonna have a bad day kind of thing, like Arkham Origins in which I have not tried yet but I'm going to give it a try so, um, yeah, um, the uh, I'm so glad I uh, have upgraded my GPU and I'm also glad that I upgraded my power supply because, um my current power supply couldn't even handle GTA 5 so it would uh, shut off my computer randomly so yeah uh, now I have uh, a newer power supply it was a it is a Corsair 750 watt uh, power supply 
I think it's a CM edition. Um, so yeah, this uh, GPU came, well, is part of the 600 series, while this GPU is part of the 9 series. Now, I was like, wait a minute, what? How is that? Like, literally, back then, uh, when NVIDIA released their uh, GPUs, it was like, when they released their, you know, their 250, and then moved on to other graphics cards, like uh, the 2 series, the 3 series, the 4 series, the FX series, the 6 series, the 7 series, the 8 series, it was always in the thousand digits. Uh, except for the 250, which was the first uh, NVIDIA GPU uh, ever created. Uh, GE Force GPU, that was, that is. So, I'm probably going to give a history of all the GPUs, all the GE Force GPUs, that is. Uh, if you want me to do that, please let me know. Um, but yeah, enough of that. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys later.